Lori and Bob, no. what's your opinion about Ron Paul? And do you believe him when he says he wants to reopen the 9 11 investigation? Ron Paul, you know, this is a man who, who gets on national television in a national debate and is asked about 9 11 truthers. And he couldn't even say that he supports the family's call for a new investigation. He couldn't even say that. That bothers me. Many of your supporters call themselves 9-11 truthers. They believe that the U.S. government was in some way complicit with the 9-11 attacks or covered it up. Are you tonight prepared to either embrace that rhetoric or ask those supporters to abandon it? or divorce themselves from your candidacy? Well, I can't tell people what to do, but I've abandoned those viewpoints. I don't believe that, and that's all. That's the only thing that is important. And so I don't endorse anything they say, but I would like to take an opportunity to talk about the issue that we've been debating here for the last 20 minutes. Sir, would you, ask them to cease that would you ask them to cease that rhetoric tonight on your behalf? Well, it doesn't do me any good, so if they care about me, they should. But the only thing I have control over is what I believe and what I say. I can't tell them what to do, so I don't endorse what they say, and I don't believe that. So please, could I participate in the current debate rather than picking this out? Please do. Please do. You know, we have people like Cynthia McKinney who's running for president. She'll never win, but she has my vote. She's done the work. She's made the effort. She's shown that she will speak truth to power. You know, that's the kind of politicians I want. I don't want people to pussyfoot around, you know, it, it, they're afraid that they're going to be politically incorrect by saying that we want a new investigation in the 9-11. That, that's absurd to me. But. John Paul is the one I read. I like him here. Um, Ron Paul said some good things. Um, I guess of all the candidates, you know, what they had to say, he said the most things, I suppose, of anybody that, you know, rang true. Uh, but I don't really trust any of these politicians, and I don't really think they have my best interests at heart, and I think they have to play, you know, in a field of bad people so that they can, you know, stay where they want to stay and play in this yep. pyramid scheme where they get the money, you know, based on the backs of the people in the American public. You know, and they get to just go and really not do that much in Washington. You know, that's how that how the system works. It's uh, broken. It's very broken. We live in a very in a, in a country that has a very broken political system. My job is to play devil's advocate here tonight, and uh, so I'll just say that uh, I plan to vote for Ron Paul. <laughs> I don't know, I think, um... He's up against killers. Yeah, I, I, I don't know, I, I mean, I think you gotta play ball a little bit when you're running for president if you want to be taken seriously, and I think that's what he's done so far, but, you know, I, I think it's the right way to go. One more thing, you know, the 9-11 Truth Movement, of all movements, should know that the election process is tainted. You know, we should know that. And we shouldn't be spending all of our time promoting Ron Paul, Cynthia McKinney, you know. It, we should be focusing on getting accountability and the truth about 9-11. You know, I support Cynthia McKinney. Okay, I said it. Now it's time to move on. Because I know that the election process is tainted, so. One of your cl former close aides recently said that you, quote, engaged in conspiracy theories including perhaps the 9-11 attacks were coordinated with the CIA and that the Bush administration might have known about the attacks ahead of time. So have you ever expressed in front of anyone... No, wait, 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 wait. Don't, 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 don't go any further than that. That's complete nonsense. It's nonsense. Just stop that. That's not, complete not nonsense. true. You, yeah. Uh, uh, no, I, I did not. And I never bought into that stuff. I never talked about it. Okay. Um, about the conspiracy of Bush, of Bush knowing about this? No, no, come on, come on. Let's be reasonable. Okay. That's just off the wall.